Hey friends, welcome back to Vincent GD's Super Channel G. Did they just really re-release the entire first wave of the 2012 Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles action figures from Playmates Toys, complete in the purple and green boxes? I guess you're gonna have to stay tuned to find out how incredible is this. But, ah, I'll just spoil it. The answer is yes. And so we're gonna take a closer look and you let us know if you want us to open them. But before I get any further, you need to know that I got these at walmart.com. Why am I telling you that? Because in our other Ninja Turtle videos, I've said, uh, I've read you guys right over and over. I wish I never got rid of my turtles. Uh, sold them at a garage sale, traded them for a Nintendo game, you know, uh, broke them, this and that. Where can I find them? Well, before they sell out, they're on walmart.com. So it came in the set of these six. I'm gonna say this again after our intro so that you can really, uh, so that you know that you have your last chance to get them. So guys, before we get started, if you're not already subscribed to our channel, please hit the subscribe button below. Hit the notification bell next to it so you're notified every time I have a new video come out. Talk to us in the comments below if you can let us know what you think of this set of six 2012 Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles reissue just in time for uh, the 10 year anniversary. And give us a big thumbs up. Talk to us in the comments. Share this video with anybody who think will enjoy it. And I'm gonna try and remember to put links to other 2012 turtles in the description, which I never do. But uh, hopefully I remember this time. So guys, what do you say we go ahead and get started? Right now. What is up, Vincent GG? Vincent GG? Super Channel G. Super Channel G. GG. Vincent GG from Super Channel G. Super Channel G. Vincent GG on Super Channel G. So tight. Don't stop doing what you're doing. Congratulations on all your success. Congratulations on everything. I will see you on the TV. Uh. Super Is this great? Hey friends, welcome back to Vincent G's Super Channel G and you are gonna flip your wig when you find out what is inside this box. Now obviously, we can read what it says right here, but you are not prepared to see what is in here. And so we're gonna get this open and take a look. And I think, again, you have a pretty great idea what is in here. And check that out, we have Mikey, and you'll recognize which version this is, and what he's riding along on. There's Raph, there's Leo, I'm like, where's Donnie? There's Donnie, this beautiful box. And there it is right there. Look what we got. Ordered this off of uh, Walmart.com. It's the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, the 2012 version of our heroes. And, and has a uh, shredder here too. And has, this is a reissue of the very um, first wave, basically, of the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles with Leonardo, Donatello, Michelangelo, Raphael, Splinter, and Shredder. And now that it's about to be, uh, well, it is the uh, coming up, the 10 year anniversary of the very first episode and season drop in Nickelodeon. This was one of the reasons why they re released this. And so, um, let's get it open. Let's take a glimpse of what exactly they look like. Are they exact replicas of the originals? And I can't wait to take a look. So you know what, let's just cut it here. And once we get it out, we look at them, you let me know if we want to open them or just collect them. Now, I'm sure you'll remember that I do have the actual originals. Well, some of them opened already and another set uh, still in their packaging. I have it in the storage unit. And oh, there's more tape here. And I'm so excited about being able to open them actually. And I haven't finished going through all of whom we have. I appreciate that. Oh my gosh, I don't even care what I was saying anymore. <laughs> all right, here we are. Let's get this box, uh, let's get these out of this box and take a closer look. And so, 
oh my gosh, in the original green and purple packaging. And before I go any further, uh, I know you guys really let me know that you're sad that you sold or gave away your original 2012 Turtles. Well, this is it. This is maybe your only chance to get them again without them being ridiculously expensive. You can get this pack of six on walmart.com before they run out. I have no idea how many more they have. I don't know how, how much longer they're gonna sell them for, but I believe that it's a walmart.com exclusive for this set. You might be able to get it at a comic book store. I don't know, I've never seen it anywhere else. And yeah, it came in a couple days. So now's your chance if you're upset that you gave away your originals, that you sold them, you lost them, you broke them, which is what you've told me on your uh, on the comments in the previous video. Well, again, Walmart.com, because I'm pretty sure they don't have them in stores. So, wow. Okay, so I had to say that. I had to give a plug because. These are unreal. Just so excited to get these, and they are in perfect condition. Look at that. Okay, so there's nothing else in here other than the tissue paper. I'm gonna set this aside. And we are gonna marvel at just how gorgeous these action figures look. My goodness. There we go. Look at that. Okay, now. Let's get even closer. And of course, we have Raphael, Leo, Donnie, Mikey, Shredder, and Splinter. And I just want to just take a closer look, marvel at how amazing these are, and it does say 2021, so these aren't just ones that were sitting in the warehouse. These are actual, you know, reissues. But wow, this is awesome. So here we have Raphael, Hothead, and Sharp Psy Expert. This beautiful packaging, beautiful artwork. The original, um, the originals were amazing. It had this awesome logo. And you have no idea how excited I am to take a look at these. And look at that right there so let's see what it says teenage mutant ninja turtles mutated from ooze and raised in the ways of ninjutsu by the rat sensei splinter the teenage mutant ninja turtles are ready to venture outside their sewer lair to fight evil everywhere so this is Raphael hothead and sharp psy expert tough Quick to act and hot tempered. Raphael's a powder keg ready to explode on unsuspecting enemies everywhere. The biggest of his mutant brothers, Raph, has a why sneak around when you can bash some heads instead attitude. Master of the twin size, these three pronged blades are the perfect reflection of their owner, sharp and to the point. Weapons, size, team, ninja turtles. Man, just watch the uh, first season again. So excited because this is absolutely my favorite version of the Ninja Turtles. Even though I did grow up watching the, the, the 80s version on TV, this is my favorite. And I uh, saw where uh, Spider Bites was making fun of Raph for his salad tongs and uh, <laughs> I calling them uh, Kung Fu Frogs or whatever. So definitely reminded me right there. Okay. Next, let's look at Donnie. It does say the very same thing up here on the write-up. And look how awesome Donnie looks. Of course, in the in this 2012 version, they only had uh, color um, masks and the rest of their their pads and, and, and stuff was, uh, the wrap was not colored. So, here we are. Donatello Inventor and Weaponeer. Did I even pronounce that right? <laughs> so here it says, Donatello Inventor and Weaponeer. Inventive and detail-oriented, 
Donatello may be the only mutant turtle that doesn't mind a little time indoors. After all, where would the ninja teens be without all his incredible battle creations? From the shell razor to the robot metalhead, Donatello's mind is just as sharp as the blade on his... I'm sorry, I don't know how to pronounce that. His bow staff. So his weapon is a six-foot bow staff with blade and Team Ninja Turtles. And if I try it, it's Naginata. Forgive me. Probably butchered that word. Okay, next is Leonardo. And he is the leader and king of, of the Katana Swords. It's absolutely gorgeous. Perfect. Uh, in perfect shape. The corners, everything. Because that bigger box really just protected them. And here it says... Leonardo, leader and king of the Katana Swords, hardworking, honorable, and respectful. Leonardo is the turtle's fearless leader. Driven to be the perfect hero, Leo's inexperience and often rowdy brothers sometimes get in the way of his goal. Weapons. Wow, I'm going to mispronounce that too. And so it's the double Katana Swords, and he is Team Ninja Turtles. Of course he is. Not just Team Ninja Turtles, he's a leader. And last but not least, from the Turtles, we have Michelangelo, jokester and hard-hitting nunchuck hero. And Mike is absolutely one of my favorites, and Greg Sipes doing the voice of Michelangelo was just outstanding. And by the way, my favorite version of Mikey was uh, Savage Mikey from when he was in Dimension X, because he was amazing. So. Michelangelo, jokester and hard-hitting nunchuck hero. Impulsive, creative, and very social. Michelangelo is the heart and soul of the Ninja Turtles, the runt of the litter. He may be the smallest of his mutant brothers, but that doesn't make him the weakest, just harder to catch. Enemies beware, Michelangelo is master of the nunchucks with a secret and sharp surprise. So his weapons are nunchucks and team turtles. Look at that. I gave up trying to pronounce those words that I have no idea. <laughs> Here is Master Splinter. We have Splinter. Honorable Sensei of the Ninja Turtles. Look at that. So here we have Master Splinter. Honorable Sensei of the Ninja Turtles. Protective and precise. Splinter is an unmatched ninja master with a playful and deep spirit that probably comes in handy raising his mutant sons, Leonardo, Raphael, Donatello, and Michelangelo. Once a human known as Hamato Yoshi, Splinter continues his tradition of teaching ninjutsu and fighting the evil Foot Clan. Weapons, hands, feet, tail, walking staff, anything and everything, Team Turtles. All right. And the very last figure in this set, this is Shredder, Deadly Leader of the Evil Foot Clan. You cannot uh, remove his mask. That was a later one that you could remove his mask. So, look how awesome that is. And here it says, Shredder, Deadly Leader of the Evil Foot Clan. Cold, cunning, and cruel. Shredder is the turtle's hateful arch enemy, willing to go to any length to destroy them and their rat sensei Splinter. With the Foot Clan and his shredding armor, there is little the Shredder can't do. Turtles beware. Weapons, forbidden ninja techniques, and razor sharp armor. Team Foot Clan. Wow. Absolutely outstanding. Let's see line these up take one last glimpse of these incredible action figures and let me know if you want us to open these already let's see who do we want I guess Leo here and have Mikey here and have Donnie here right Let's spread these out just a smidge. And, you know, even though we're 
covering shredder. I think this still looks awesome. What do you think? So, uh, give me one second. Let me see if I can take a picture here. Okay, perfect. Thank you guys. So, let me know in the comments what you want us to do. These look absolutely amazing. Look at that. Another picture. All right, and let me know what you think. Who is your favorite turtle? And which one uh, excites you the most? I am extremely excited about the possibility that they may even release more so that we can get the figures that we missed, even though I'm pretty sure we have almost all of them by now. But this is just such a great, great iteration of the turtles. So guys, talk to me in the comments. We'll be seeing you soon. Check back on our YouTube channel for more great videos like this. And um, I know I keep promising this and I keep not doing it, but check the description uh, below so that hopefully I can put the links to the other turtle uh, videos we have. If it's not there right away, check back soon. So guys, I wanna thank you for hanging out with us here on Vincent GD's Super Channel G. Peace.